I got a new car! What's going on everybody? I'm Jason, Chicago Auto Pros. I just got a, well brand new to me, it's not brand new, it's 2016 MK7 GTI. Super excited, I've been looking at these for a few months and super excited that I pulled the trigger on it. I'm gonna do a whole video series on this. We have lots of stuff that I wanna do this. We're gonna do a whole transformation video. So we're gonna have separate videos on all these things and I have a laundry list of things that I wanna do to this. Also, any suggestions on what you've done to your own GTI, I'd love to hear those. First thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna replace this window tint. It, it looks all right, but there's a lot of little bubbles and everything, and there's a big gap on both these edges here, and then they did not window tint these two front ones. I also wanna do the full windshield tint, so I'll do a whole separate video on removing that tint and then retinting it so you guys can see how that's done. We got some dents, it has some small damage. This is the biggest dent right here on the side. So we'll have Dennis, our dent guy, come out and pop those dents out. There's a couple on the roof too, so we're gonna take those out and then I'm gonna put Dino Steck film on here. It's a black paint protection film and it matches this front really well because this is nice shiny black. It looks weird here that it's just white. I want that whole roof to be black. So we're gonna put black paint protection film on there and it, it, you won't even be able to tell it's film. It looks painted, awesome film. We'll go over that. Love to do some performance stuff to it. Get some new rims. These rims have some road rash on here. So what I'm thinking is I get some summer rims, some nice rims and tires. And then I can use these. I'll put winter tires on this because I am going to drive this in the winter. So I'll have that on there. Love to lower it. Intake, new exhaust. I want to do separate videos on all this and show you guys the transformation and on what this uh, looks like now. It's Right now, it's as it sits, it does have the performance package. So it does come with the leather seats. It's a six-speed manual. Right now, it's pulling about 220 horsepower. That's what it says from factory. Um, love to dyno it, we'll get the exact specs on it, and then as we do stuff, as we tune it, as we do some exhaust and some other performance parts on it, we'll show you guys uh, what kind of power we're getting out of it. But this is my first kind of enthusiast car that I've ever had. I'm really excited to put some time and some uh, blood and tears into this thing and all my crap from my old car. <laughs> So I'm excited to start this transformation on this project. I've never done anything to a car besides do an oil change or put gas in it. So I'm excited to learn the different mods that you can do. If you guys have any suggestions on what I should do of what you've done to your own GTIs, I'd love to hear it in the comments below. Let me know. Uh, if there's anybody out there that has a company that would uh, like to help me out, maybe sponsor me for some performance parts or anything that I can do on the vehicle, I'd love to hear from you there. Uh, but otherwise, I'm excited to show you guys this and, and learn on how to do all this stuff and uh, thanks for watching subscribe we'll see you next time that's where the supercharger is <laughs> supercharger e-force it's a quad quad turbo quad turbo yep quad turbo with the uh, quadruple injection yep <laughs> it's got a triple supercharger